Small all right, all right. Peace and shalom, family. Peace and shalom. What's going on? Give me a second. All right. Thank you all for waiting. I appreciate that. All right. We're about to get started with the show shortly. Okay. I'm just waiting for uh, my counterpart for him to um, get situated. All right. Uh, to start the show because I didn't want everybody to be hanging in here. Um, and I wanted to get some time for us to begin. All right. So, uh, shout out to my brother DB in the building, Stephen McKinney, Shalom, my brother Gartrell McKinney, Shalom, Yosef Donald, Otis Miller, Jetson Silencio, Shalom, Shalom, Torio, the Most High, Yesha Moore, what's going on, uh, Riolan T, Consuelo F, Shalom, Sis, Salav Judah, what's going on, Aki, what's going on, Matiahu Ben Israel, what's going on, Big Main in the building, JD Israel, Araya Yisrael, what's going on, family? Track News Live, what's going on? What's going on, family? Malik Prize, Shabbat Shalom to you as well. All right, fam, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Family, make sure you share this. Shout out to Kingdom Conscious in the building, the Most High Child, Shayarala, what's going on? Yahweh Sop, Son of Light, my sister, 916 Shan Shan. She said she's not taking no more students for Hebrew and Greek. It's okay, okay? Hopefully, she'll be back in the game soon. Value the sister. All right. <laughs> Shout out to Tina M in the building. What's going on? What's going on? All right. So um, we're about to get started shortly, family. So what I'm going to do uh, before I bring him on is I'm going to get the show started. Um, I just need some more likes. Thumbs up button. Get, get, get the show some more likes so we can go in for y'all. Give you a really interesting show. OK. Um, I haven't seen my brother Brandon on anybody's platform recently speaking. Um, and if y'all know the history and go back, I'm going to show some throwback footage and stuff like that. That, um, you know, he was he first appeared on my platform. Right. Um, when I did a, a event back in 2016, uh, where I was supposed to debate a pastor, a pastor never showed up. And at that time, Brandon was talking about his kingdom culture clothing. Right. He's evolved to that. now social mobile banking platform. Right. It is a social commercial commercial um point of sale entity that has some social network integration into it um you can use it as a pos if you have a business to do transactions it's just i mean it's a entire ecosystem within itself with various components and i mean you can get so much accomplished within the platform itself and this is something that i think we need in our community so that we, we can achieve autonomy uh brandon knows how I feel about autonomy, right? Uh, me and him been talking about this past four and a half years, man. It's been a long time me and him been rapping about this. And um, he's finally come out with a venture that I support. And I want to give him an opportunity to feature it here um, on KHM because, you know, that's what we that's what we're about, right? So um, we're going to try to have a dynamic show for you guys, man. Afro-Asiatic, Shemitic, Hebrew, A-A-S-H. What's going on? Sister V-Love in the building. Malaka Shal Ahmad. What's going on? Ya Alon Ben Israel. What's going on, family? Hit that thumbs up, family. Hit that thumbs up. Share this video. Hit subscribe if you're brand new. And check out the archive. Remember, 24-7-365, the after party is on our Patreon. www.patreon.com backslash divine prospect. All right. Shout out to 617. Let's get it. What's going on? All right. Y'all ready? Let me know if you're ready for the show, man. Let me know if you're ready for the show. And a couple of things together here so y'all can check it out. But let me know when you're ready for the show. You know, I want to bring up, I want to get this uh, old school piece together real quick. It's not really old school, but it's a couple of years old. I'm going to show you the bill we had uh, behind closed doors. Never seen, never before seen footage. Uh, okay, there we go. Let me go ahead and pull it out the archives real quick. Right. Let me shoot my brother the link so he has the link. Let me do that as well. 
Hey, okay, family, hit that thumbs up. Share this with your family, your friends. Get them in the building. Get them in the building. Shout out to Hokma Cafe. What's going on? What's going on, Joshua Benjamin? What's going on? Uh, let me see. I think that's everybody. If you want to shout out, hit one. Somebody says your Wi-Fi is acting up. My Wi-Fi is acting up. Oh, it's not good. It's not good. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me see what's There's going no on. Wi-Fi. Let me see. This should not have no volume. Um, is it still going crazy for y'all? Let me know if it's working. It look, it look okay on my end. I'm looking at it. Is it good? Is it still acting up? Let me know. Let me know if it's good. Oh, I see it did it, it did lock up a little bit. I don't know what's going on. Something else might be dragging things down. Um, so let me do this. Let me switch over real quick. Let me switch over real quick. It could be something that is somebody says it's freezing bad. Well, that's definitely not good. Okay. Let me know if this is working better. Somebody says it's perfect on their end. Let me know if this is working better. I apologize for that, family. I'm not sure what is going on 100%, but hopefully we have a good show. We don't have any of those issues. I'll let this is better. better. Let me know if this is better, family. Hold on. Let me know if this is better. I'm transitioning over right now. Just give me a second. Uh, let's go here. Um, still chopping. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see if it's still chopping. Um. Okay. Is this better? I don't know if this is better. It's good now. Uh, this is crazy. All right, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let me see what's going on. Nah, DB, I'm not using a VPN. If I was using a VPN, that would be my bandwidth. Um, yeah, yeah, I see it. I see it chopping up. I see what y'all saying. Man, yo, those I'm I'm telling you, man, those trolls is hard at work, man. <laughs> and they don't this show. Give me one second. Let me see uh what the culprit could be. Let me see. Let me see. Um uh, okay. All right. I, I, I'm, Let me see. Let me see if there's what else could I do? Yeah. All right. Um, try it out on my laptop. Yeah, give me a second. Um, I'm a I'm a I'm a spy on my laptop. I'll be right back, y'all. Don't go no. I'll be right back, all right?
All right. All right. Um, let me let me know if this is if this is better. Let me see. All right. All right. Is this better? Y'all let me know if this is better. Let me know if this is better. Can y'all hear me better? Can y'all see me better? Let me know. Is it better? Said the audio is not good. All right, let's see. Let's see what's going on. All right, how about this? Is this better? Is the audio better? Let me know if the audio is better. It's good. All right, all right, cool, cool. Man, that was crazy, man. All right, I hate technical difficulties. Oh, man. I don't know, the last live stream. All right, cool, cool. All right, let's get busy. Brandon is like, yo, what's going on? He he freaking out. You feel me? So all right, let me let me um let me get situated now since I'm on my laptop. Uh, let me let me give reach out over to him. All right, there we go. Right. Right. All right, family. All right. The choppiness is back. Uh, okay, let me see. I apologize for this family. I might have to kill this session and do it over again. That That's not going to be good because I sent the link out. Um... Yeah, something is, yeah, I agree. <laughs> it's a closure background application. That's already, it's not that, this thing going on. It's probably some issues with the gateway, the modem that I had, or something else um, interfering with the bandwidth. My throughput is fine, it's just probably the bandwidth. Um, <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I, I used to I used to be wired. I'm not wired anymore. I might I might just go wired in one second since this is not working. All right, so just give me a second. Let me try something. I'm gonna try one more thing real quick. Hopefully this works. Otherwise, I have to. All right, so give me a second. Let me see something.
All right. So I am back. I'm hoping this is much better. Y'all let me know if this is much better before I get started. <laughs> Trust me, I'm definitely not know McDonald's Wi-Fi. That's definitely not happening over here. I can't be a techie and be on no unsecured McDonald's Wi-Fi. So I definitely will have to use a VPN for that. All right, so um, is that better? Is that better? Is that better? All right, let me, hopefully I don't lose my guests in the process. Let's see. All right, let me see. All right. All right, so y'all let me know if it stays this way. I had to make some drastic changes <laughs> um, to get it to go smoother smoother for y'all okay so if it's consistent i think we should be good um i think i am ready let me grab this other piece over here and i think i should be good so right now i'm just waiting for him to join in and then we can get started. Again, y'all let me know, make sure everything is good. Sorry for the 20 minutes or so. Uh, we was having some difficulty. Uh, let me see. All right, so as we wait, family, um, I wanna go ahead and play uh, the video here for, for you guys. Give me one second. Let me get this video ready. All right. Okay. Um. Joshua, you asking a lot of questions. Interestingly enough, I addressed that after like thing in a live stream. So go back on this channel, do a search through the videos. You can type in afterlife and then you'll see the live stream where I touched on that. All right. Hopefully that begins to answer your question for you. All right. All right. I'm going to go ahead and play this video for y'all. Just give me a second. Randy Jackson. All right. Okay. All right, so I want y'all to check out this video as I'm waiting for my guests to jump in. All right, check out this video real quick. Let's make sure, yeah, we don't have, okay. Trying to get directly wired into my router from my laptop. Um, I don't know what that was about. All right, here we go. Why is it not showing that? Let's minimize that. All right. Yeah, y'all can ask him that questions when he when he gets on. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and play the snippet for you real quick. So y'all can see it. All right, I'm gonna play it here for y'all. 
Matthew Jackson, co-founder, chairman, and CEO of Kingdom Pay. Oh, my name is Mark Bush, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of Kingdom Pay. And my partner, Mark, and I are very excited about bringing this robust platform to an underserved and underbanked community. All the way to the savvy financial consumer looking for a nice fintech product on the market. How does Kingdom Pay work? Very simple. You just attach your digital wallet to your bank account, and you're able to make transactions. You can do direct deposit, also peer-to-peer conversations, streaming, U.S. transfer, consider and receive gifts, post content, earn points, and manage your rewards. Connect with friends and earn points, send and receive gift cards, post content and earn points, manage your awards programs. And we're more than just a community. We are a lifestyle. Follow us on Instagram at Kingdom Pay Official. So go to KingdomPay.com, sign up so you can be updated for our future launch, which is right around the corner. Kingdom Pay. Why? Because Kingdom Pay. All right, all right. Okay, so that was just an intro to the Kingdom Pay platform. All right. Um, Somebody saying, why are we talking about money on the Shabbat? Wow. So let me break it down like this, okay? Um, If you have an issue with us discussing a commerce platform, are we are we exchanging anything? No. Okay. Um, Our observance of the Sabbath is from sunrise to sunset. So that's the period of time that we reserve from resting from our labors as well as refraining as much as we can from buying and selling during that period of time, okay? We've had discussions about on this about the Sabbath, um, and you're saying something about talking about money. Now, if this offends you, okay, then you may not wanna stay here for the rest of the show, okay? If you have an issue with this, then we definitely can have a dialogue. I could bring you in on the platform uh, Brandon, I see you, Brandon. Just give me a second. You're in the background. I'm going to bring you on in one second. All right. So if you have an issue with this, uh, then you can you can go. Or we can bring you on later if you want to go on an open panel discussion. And uh, you can just bring up whatever your concern is and we can address it. Okay. If you want to get into the scriptures in regards to the Sabbath, anything like that, wherever you want to take it, we can go. Okay. It's that simple. All right. But please don't disrupt you know what I'm saying? What we're about to discuss, this is very pertinent to our community. It's critical that you guys pay attention and understand the things that we're talking about. My brother, Brandon T. Jackson, his time is extremely valuable. The brother is always busy doing something positive and constructive. I can co-sign that from the times that I've seen him and even stayed at his house with his family, you know what I'm saying, to the times that you know I bumped into him in the street and we talked on the phone, this brother is always into something. So I'm bringing him here at a time where he could be resting, he could be studying, he could be working on his next creative project for you guys. So if anybody has an issue with the brother being on the platform, on the issue that we're talking about, the Kingdom Pay platform, uh, which has to do with achieving full autonomy, then this is not the show for you, okay? You wanna come into a show where we're discussing doctrine or we arguing, fighting and all of that, you can come at another time, all right? Okay? It was a question. Okay, no problem. All right. So you guys saw the uh, platform. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a quick summary. Not going to go too long into it. I'm going to introduce my brother who's waiting in uh, in the stage room. And um, from there, I'm going to let him take off and um, share some stuff with you. Me and him are going to get into a nice little interesting build. And um, we're going to really see if you guys is about autonomy, man, self-governance, self-sustainability, and being able to keep things within our community without always having to be tethered to the external systems. All right. So the first thing I want to say is this is my brother, Brandon C. Jackson. Um, I met the brother formally back in 2016. I think it's the beginning of 2016. So it's been about four and a half years uh, since I met the brother. I met him through a, a, a mutual associate uh, named Malak Yosef. 
Um, he told me that he was speaking with Brandon C. Jackson and a couple of other brothers, and they were uh, looking to do something for the community. And he invited me on to the teleconference. And that's when, you know, uh, Brandon was speaking, other brothers were speaking, I was speaking. Brandon's like, man, who was that brother that was just speaking? He's like, oh, that's Devon. I was like, so yeah, man, I want to I wanna build that brother. And I said, okay, cool. So me and him talked outside of that. We built up a good uh, relationship, good friendship. And then I came out to L.A., in 2016, and this is uh, during the time where Brandon was starting to come on the scene about him being Israelite, but he was being very tactful because remember, he still is working in Hollywood, or excuse me, Hollywood, and um, he still uh, was under certain contracts. So he didn't want to compromise anything until he was able to complete those projects and then fully come into the kingdom. Uh, during that period of time, that's when I heard about Brandon T. Jackson um, before I got on that conference call, and I saw a few videos he had did uh, from his cell phone about, you know, the kingdom and stuff like that. And I was like, wow, that'd be interesting if that brother really gets into the truth because, you know, I watched his movies in the past and anybody that knows me knows that one of my favorite movies of all time, you ask my family members, my friends, is Tropic Thunder. And that brother stole the show. You know what I'm saying? Him and uh, Robbie Downey Jr. stole the show. You know what I'm saying? So um, to see that he was saying, yo, I'm going to go and, um, you know, identify as an Israelite because he's been in the faith for a while. If you guys don't know his father, um, Wayne C. Jackson, his father, you know, is well known in Detroit. You know what I'm saying? He's has a huge church in Detroit. He has his own network. Um, from what Brandon had told me now, you know, the word network, which is a Christian network, if none of y'all is not familiar with it, uh, has been absorbed by his uh, overarching network. So, I mean, Brandon was just in a lineage in regards to the faith. You know what I'm saying? The only difference is Brandon came into the awakening about our identity as Israelites, right? And how it pertains to the entire uh, scheme of the Most High's plan for his people. Um, so when I went out there to meet the brother, you know, I had an event and I said, hey, Brandon, do you want to speak at the event? Brandon's like, yeah, you know. He'd be more than happy to. So I was supposed to debate a pastor. Pastor didn't show up. So I just did a session. I had two guests. Brandon was the second guest. He came on in talking about his kingdom culture clothing at that time, which he's still doing. And this is why when you see the brother in pictures and stuff like that, the garments that he's wearing is from his kingdom culture clothing line, which you can expound on further. And then the brother came. And after that, we started building. And Sakari was there. And that's when he found out Sakari was the one that made the video. Oh, Brandon C. Jackson is an Israelite now. And then afterwards, we went out to dinner to go eat. We had a great time afterwards. And um, everything was kosher, man. It's no complaints, man. I stayed with him, met his family and all of that. You know, the brother is the real deal. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, you know, when I meet celebrities, they one way here, one way there. I can't say that about this brother, man. And um, he came under so much scrutiny, so much firepower, so much oppression from the time that he decided to identify as Israelite, not only from the media, right? Not only from society, but from his own people, even to the point where it was almost his own family. You know what I'm saying? And the brother was willing to give it all up for the kingdom. And you can't say that about a lot of these other celebrities that's claiming the truth. You know what I'm saying? And I know personally by knowing the brother, you know, like I said, meeting his family, spending face-to-face -face time with him, chatting with him, that he's the real deal. Right. So without further ado, let me bring on my brother, Brandon T. Jackson. So that way he can come on here and uh, he can give you guys a little bit about him, uh, what's been going on with him lately and uh, introduce you to Kingdom Pay. Right. And as he talks about Kingdom Pay, then I'll explain things to y'all as far as like what is fintech, you know, financial technology, the crossover integration of financial uh, elements that's integrated into technology so you can create deliver rules, right? Um, no matter if you have a point of sale system or if you have some kind of accounting system. So I'll get into the little technicalities as far as that because I'm familiar with that technology because I'm a solutions engineer, the stuff that I do. Um, but he's gonna show you how this technology has been integrated into our community and how it benefits the kingdom. That means all of us, all right? So Brandon, are you ready? Okay, so let me go ahead and bring him on. All right, KOE. King. Everything is in the building. What's going on, Brandon? How are you? I'm I'm very good. Thank you so much for that uh, intro. And you know, I <laughs> yeah, I, I be getting it, man. They be getting me. They, you know, and I'm not a victim though. I don't I don't I don't get I'm not victimized by it. I don't be like oh my god, but um, you know, it hurts. It does hurt because I try my best, and even if things ever like, you know, I was telling, I'm talking about my friend the other day. If ever, anything ever goes wrong with other nations, they they fail up. When I was in the world in Hollywood, if brothers brothers would do a movie. They met they movie don't do good one time and they go down. Us, you know, 
uh, with 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 the other nations, they 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 can do a bomb movie and they they fall up. So we have to have more mercy on our our people in general with anything we do because it's like just to to, to have any autonomy, you have to have the grace of of everyone bringing their ideas to the table. And it's like I brought this idea to the table, and I feel like I'm just getting, you know, eaten up by the community. And I mean, I'm 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 getting Hollywood. You know, they're they're like, what's he doing? And Israel's like, what is he doing? <laughs> and that's how you know the most high is doing something because you ain't accepting both worlds. Yeah. So um it hurts, but I ain't gonna cry about it. You know, lions, we lick our wounds, we keep we keep walking. You know, I ain't mad about it, but it does hurt when you know what the father's doing, when you know what you have, you know what you have to offer for the people, and it's what they've been praying for. Yeah. And I'm not oh, it's not about Brandy Jackson bringing this, it's about the most high bringing in this. And if I'm just a face to help it get out there, or a brand a brand face to help it get out there, it's not me doing this. It's the Most High. All praise to the Most High, you know. Um, and Shabbat Shalom to you, brother. Um, yeah, you too. I'm huh? just, you know, I'm just like, you know, I heard you talking, and everybody, you know, I'm always getting beat up, but I'm not a victim though. I'm not mad about it. It's just like, it's like, yo, don't they? How can you not see if the Spirit is with you? How can you not see? You can't talk about these. The, the, these big entities and go up unless God is with you. Because you saw what happened to Nick Cannon. You Everyone saw what happened. They pulled the show. How am I talking against the system and going up? Mm. Mm. That's How deep. am I talking against Hollywood and going up? If Facts. I'm not the real deal. Facts. Why do we got to always prove to Israel that we were from Moses' time, David's time? Why do we always have to prove to the stiff neck generation that we are that we are who we say we are. And mm -hmm. I'm not saying everybody is. But the ones that's getting the most flat might be the ones that the most high is using. And I, I don't care about that. I don't care about fame no more. If I did, I, I, I wouldn't. Bro, hold on. Let me show you something. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm, I'm just going to bring it out. I'm going to bring you're, it out. bringing that lion out tonight, man. Because <laughs> I'm mad because, because I'm a little mad, but I'm not going to be mad, man. Look. Nah, you good. It's righteous, righteous anger, my brother. Go ahead. Let the people know. Look, 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 look. What's that? Where's that at? That's Eddie Murphy and me. Mm. That's, wow. that's all gone. That's all gone. This wow. is a toy. A toy. Wow. I got my own toy from Tropicana. That's that's all gone. That's just all gone. <laughs> wow. This, this is done. This is all gone. All this. Wow. Look. Little cop, I don't give a crap about this. Is just memories to show me in Egypt. That's it. Mm. That's all mm. gone. All of it is gone. It's gone. I don't mm. care. I don't care about it, bro. And people get so like, oh, because I know God about to do something bigger than that. Mm. Most high about that. to kill that. That's just what. That's the allurement of the Satan saying, oh, I can make you give you all the kingdoms of the world. Mm -hmm. So what can the Most High do if you turn that stuff down? And that's what I was trying to tell Nick. I'm like Nick. Bro, and I'm not hating on Nick because I love the brother, but I think we got to study Torah enough to go against anything that's 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 coming against the truth. Period. Facts. Period. Facts. And so let me, I was let me, able to talk to a lot of you know we, we you know we get into that. I just it's just like a yeah yeah no problem. I just want you to I just want you to get off your chest. I want to let you know that you are at home right now. The people that watch this. <laughs> I feel like you see my <laughs> I'm WWFing you know what I mean? over here, like, bro. Yeah, yeah. Nah, you know, you know, you look, I know you. I know you. Yeah, yeah. You I know. stay here. You know what I'm saying? Facts. With the fam. So, Facts. same house. Facts. That's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like. No, you, 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 like I said, you are thorough 100%. Matter of fact, every time you came to Atlanta to do your shows, I was there. Yes, you was. And yeah. you could see the spirits. That's yeah. Right. I, it, and it's not about no celebrity. Oh, divine trying to come out. I I saw you out. I was like, yo, what's up with the chat? See you debating. See you talking to cats. You know, you know, four years ago, I yeah. saw you out. So yeah. There was no groupie. Oh, blah blah blah. It was none of that. It was just Facts. real. And Facts. I'm not perfect at all, but I'm real. I'm not perfect, but I'm real. And you're transparent. So what I want to say, I want to say to the family that um, you know. Brendan T. Jackson, he has something great, but you got to understand most of the people who the Most High chooses don't ask for it. 
Like, like Brandon exactly. didn't actually call him. He didn't act exactly. behind you. He, he, there you go. He could have stayed a celebrity, right? He could have been even a celebrity in the Christian church doing Christian comedy and stuff like that. Yeah. The brother decided that he was going to lay those things aside so that way he can follow the kingdom. And when we say exactly. the kingdom, we're not talking about the secular kingdom. We're talking about the kingdom of the most high is bringing, but he has to bring it through us. And he has to prep the hearts of the people to wake up those bones in the dry valley. And he has to use certain people to speak to them. He has a lane, which he's doing it. I have a lane. Other people in our community have a lane. And as we respect people in their respective lane, the objective is, how do you know that person is consistent and real? You just watch their life. This brother's been mm -hmm. doing it for four and a half years. So many celebrities I've seen talk about, oh, we the people, we the people. Where they at now? They, they ain't doing people. nothing. You, I had yeah, meetings with them. And I'm not trying to be haters on people, but I'm saying, bro, I'm real. I'm from Detroit, bro. And I, I call stuff out. These dudes, so many people are BSing fully, bro. Straight up. I ain't gonna lie. I they 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 BSing. They BSing. And you and like I said, you and now they're scared though. Yeah. That, all, most high be the glory. I'm not trying to, I don't want to ever boast myself up because I gotta make sure I don't do that. Cause it's yeah. coming from the inside. Let me be more. Let me be more. Um, because they might they they might see this. Let me be more. Um, compassionate. I'm gonna catch myself because I'll be going hard sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be overdoing it sometimes. But let me just catch myself. Um, when someone else is controlling your money, it is harder to walk away from it. Say it like that, without that faith of Abraham. Uh -huh. He said, "Go away. I'll make you great." They don't. You gotta have that. If you don't have that, and I attest to my my father. You know, being in, in my grandfather, my lineage, I'm like, I'm called to do whatever, whatever he most had me to do. Excuse me. In this season and in, and in life and this whole in this whole movement, because um, I looked at it, it was like, OK, why am I the only one that really believes God the way I like if God controls everything? Why are we scared of these men? And I don't think because the lifestyle of a celebrity, you got to be able to give that up. And yeah. it's very hard when if, if you don't have nothing else. Correct. You know, even if, I have, even if I start getting money again like I used to, I'm not even gonna do the extra stuff. Like, I mean, I'm not saying it's wrong, but I was telling, I said, babe, I'm just gonna get me a Jeep or something. I'm gonna chill with the Jeep. I'm gonna give me a custom made Jeep. I'm gonna be out here on the beach. I'm chilling. I'm on some <laughs> earth type. For yeah, real, I'm know. on some chill stuff. I'm not on the, you know, the, you know, I ain't on this mode. <laughs> I might. I already did the ride out Bentleys. And look, look, you're not, you're not, you're not trying to get trapped in a trap, man. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to keep it like, and that's. I'm like, babe. I said, I think I changed. I want to just, I want to just buy guns and jeeps. And that's it. I know it sounds bad to say. I'm not, you know, I'm just saying, but yeah. I'm like, I'm more of a, you know, let's go farm, let's farm, yeah. babe. Let's get these goats. I'm like on that mode. Right. But, but yeah, that's autonomy. So uh, to interject, what I want to say, Brandon, is maybe the people may not be aware of it. Uh, can you just give them a few minutes on your awakening process, right? How did you awaken to the identity of uh, realizing that you're an Israelite and that the Most High has called you to do kingdom work? Because we know, you know, you was raised under your father, mm -hmm. and your grandfather, who are big, well-known preachers in the city of Detroit. But your particular journey, we want to know what woke Brandon up. It was a combination of things. I started thinking like, wait a minute, why do Hollywood got so much power? I was, it, was, it was a bunch of stuff. Like I started thinking like, okay, wait a minute. Okay, when I found out I was a slave, this is how I found out I was a slave on a set of Big Mamas is when I was on a Fox lot. No, I was on a set of Percy Jackson too. Mm -hmm. And I was on a Fox lot and I'm on the phone with the producer and I said, I don't want to get an address. And they were like, well, we're going to write the scene where you got to get in. I don't know if it's a three strikes you out with the most high, but they got is an agenda with that dress stuff. But they're trying to get me in a dress again for Percy Jackson, too. And I was arguing. I'm like, I don't want to do this. I just got in a dress with Big Mamas. They was like, you see, either you get in a dress or we're going to take other actions. And I'm like, wow. my mom, what are these other actions? Call my lawyer. My, my. There's like, bro, get in a dress. I'm like, wait, I thought. Y'all gonna defend me again. <laughs> tell me wow. to write the scene out. No, yeah. tell me to write the scene out. Yeah. So I realized I can't, I never forget that moment. It was a very defining moment. I looked at the Simpsons poster on Fox Live. And I was like, I'm a slave. Mm. That was the beginning of me going, huh, 
I have no power here. Wow. I was like, I'm really a slave. I started thinking like, but God, because I always had that faith in me because, you yeah. know, even you look at Mark 9, 23, I got tattoos of faith all over me, even though it was coming from a, a Christian perspective at the time, I still knew God was wrong. Like, you know, my dad didn't teach me this. My dad didn't teach me, he said, God said, if you believe all things are possible. So my mind, like, these people got too much power. What's like, what's going on? So make a long story short, um, you know, I start searching a little bit later after that when God started stripping me and showing me certain things and things weren't feeling the same. Strip clubs wasn't feeling the same. Uh, things, just, it just wasn't right. It was, you know, it just was like, no, nah, this ain't, this ain't, this can't be the meaning of life. And so I started studying and I grew up in a, a primarily Jewish neighborhood. I don't know if you know me. I grew up uh, from, from 13 to you know, my whole high school years, from middle school to high school, I was all in a Jewish neighborhood, and they would always tell me to pray to my God. You know, you guys are the chosen people, you know. And my dad always taught us that you got to follow the ways of the Jews. Even when we're Christians, you got to follow the ways of the Jews. He always told uh, us that from the child. So it was like in there. Then he changed his church to the Sabbath. Uh -huh. just got mad. So I put the pieces together, and then I saw this video on YouTube about how we had children in Israel. I was like, that makes sense. That <laughs> made, like my whole life like flashed in front of us. And I saw Hollywood, I saw my childhood, I saw uh, everywhere. And I was like, I just went like, I went on fire. Y'all remember I was <laughs> on the rooftops yelling mad. Like, Cause I knew so much from the inside. Yeah. And I was like, wait a minute, you know this. And I realized like without economic power, Mm. You know, that's that's really all that you know. Certain certain groups of people have. They need our sauce. They need our anointing. They need our mm. our, our, mm. Our, 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 our 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 uh our faith. Our 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 energy. Mm -hmm. They need that to defile. They gotta defile it. Mm. Put them in a the dress. Put that. To put that because they get they got devour us, so God won't accept us. Ah, there you go. Go ahead. So then I start putting a piece together. Like, well, every, why everything I do is against this 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 Bible right here? Why wow. everything I do is against my Bible? Because I was a wow. Christian. That. I yeah, yeah. On the map, and I start reading the Old Testament. Everything I say, everything y'all want to do in Hollywood is against God. Mm. Period. Mm. So then Mosai, I left, got baptized, went to Israel. Everybody on that story, if they remember it, um, four years ago. And God downloaded the, the, the vision of the kingdom. And in my mind, and I saw it in a way where, you know, we all could win. It wasn't yeah. Brandon. It was I'm standing side by side by you and nobody better than nobody. That's why you can get me on the phone. All the people talking junk, all y'all elders and people talking junk, I ain't going to name names. My phone number has not changed. Divine can call all y'all talking to junk. Call me. You can call me. Uh -huh. You got to talk with your brother. Call me. Because uh -huh. I, uh -huh. Divine, do I pick the phone? Yes, sir. Can you get me actually, on the phone? Actually, actually, you be having a hard time getting me. <laughs> I must say, yo, I call you more. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. you say, yeah. Exactly, but that's true, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I, I rub people the wrong way because my personality is very, you know, I'm just vibrant. I'm just like that. So I kind of rub people right. the wrong way sometimes. So they might get, you know, they may, I might come off arrogant some people. I may come off misunderstood. Um, you know, well, let me tell you something. Got to communicate. Let, let me tell you and, something. When that, when those things happen, Brandon, when your character surfaces, right? Two things happen. The first thing is sometimes people will be threatened by what you have to offer or what you're contributing, right? Because they're lacking. Number one or number two, they have insecurities, right? You should never have to devalue what Yah has put in you to please other people, okay? Because a true leader or somebody who is willing to know how to cultivate people, know how to work with that, right? Because mm -hmm. if, I'm, if, I'm a, if I'm a blacksmith, you can give me any metal on earth, I know how to handle it, right? I know how to shape it, I know how to form and fashion it, right? If I do pottery, 
You could put me anywhere where there's any type of pottery and I'll be able to make it work. The problem is a lot of these people who are in leadership roles, they do not know how to handle things that y'all have given them because they're used to bossing over people and people not being outspoken and saying, hey, we should share this or hey, we should do that. A lot of times they get rubbed the wrong way because they are not built for that. And you have to understand that y'all is doing a pruning process. So sometimes things has to surface so he can cut some branches off to make room for new growth. And it's always seasons in which that happens, right? So I don't want you to get frazzled because you are extremely valuable to our community. You are the mouthpiece when we can't speak to in certain areas to certain people. I follow you all the time on social media. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah, I text you. We've, we've talked several times over the years. And I'll be in L.A. again this year. Right. Well, I mean, I like, yeah. Hey, yo, my house is always open to you. Yeah. Um, yeah. for all the priests out there, know that I'm I'm I I love the priests. Some of these priests I think aren't priests. I'm just gonna talk real right now. And I just believe that some we gotta come together. If we priests, if the priests are here, because I don't I don't claim to be a priest. Um, I don't claim to be anything but a servant. I don't know. I, I don't know. I know. I think I know where the father has me, but I'm not going to say it because I don't got time for the, oh, he think he, mm. you know, I done, I done met 20 King Davids. I done met 15 Moses. <laughs> I done met so many. I'm done. I'm yeah. done with it. I'm yeah. done. Listen, I'm going to tell y'all this, Israel, I'm done with it. If you are that, then I need to see it. Mm. So part the Red Sea, if you got, if you, if you David, you got money. I'm done. If you David, don't ask me for money. Mm. Mm. If you say you David, don't hey, I'm David, nigga. Hey, get him brought five dollars. <laughs> no, David ain't gonna ask that. Facts. I'm being real. I'm, I'm done. I'm not meeting no more Davids. I'm done meeting Moses. I met 10 Jeremiah's. I'm done. I am done with the rent. I don't know what it is. If y'all reincarnated, it's somebody lying. I, I'm somebody lying. lying. Definitely. Somebody ain't Moses. Somebody ain't David. Somebody ain't Jeremiah. Don't, I don't want to hear. It. I if you are that. All praise to the most high. I'm not gonna fight you on that. I'm saying that I know my I know that the father got me on this path, whatever this is for. Right now, it may switch up. We never we might go. We don't know what the father gonna do. I try to come as a babe. Like I don't know what he's gonna do, Father. Mm -hmm. I let him work. Mm -hmm. All Fair. I know, I, you told us to gather. That's common sense. Get with each other and do the little the babe milk things first. Because I believe we start doing the milk things, we can start to become a nation. Facts. But we doing the meat, we arguing over meat. So, so yeah. let me ask you. So, what inspired the Kingdom Pay? Right? Because I want to get into the Kingdom Pay, and then we're gonna uh, talk about two other things afterwards. But what inspired the Kingdom Pay? Because I remember when I first met you. We were talking about kingdom culture, and you was uh, talking about the clothing line first. Kingdom clothing, yes, correct. So, yeah. so when, right when now I, we, it's just yeah. kingdom clothing. But I was at, when I first met you, it was kingdom culture was the whole platform, the kingdom Fact. platform. Yeah, Fact. and then it turned into kingdom clothing. And then um, at that time, when I met you, um, you was talking about the importance of culture in regards to clothing, right? Being able for the world to see that the garments that you wear represents what it is that you're about. Yes. That's what yes. we can say about you since then is that even when you take pictures with these celebrities, you looking fly. You feel what yeah. I'm saying? Like you got the kingdom of tile, you yeah. know what I'm saying? When they see it, they're like, no, that's different. You know what I'm saying? I seen you in uh, 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 newspaper pictures and magazine pictures and online blogs where people's coming to see you. And they're always talking about your clothing. And what people don't realize is that your regalia is what makes you set apart as well. Because yes. that's the first thing people will see before they even hear you open your mouth. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna see that. So when they see that, they gotta step back and they gotta just absorb that that righteous energy and say, wow, that, that's a king right there, or somebody with that type of aura, and they're not seeing us, right? They're seeing yes. the ruler. You know what I'm yes. saying? So we've given a body for the Ruach to do its thing. And that's why I appreciate it when you came on the uh, on, in my uh, event and you spoke about that. And I was like, wow, this brother got, he, he's getting somewhere with this. You know, And you went from that to kingdom pay. Like you didn't, you didn't jump, did an evolutionary leap. You know what I'm saying? So the most high is doing, I'm not doing, I can't take any glory for it. The most high put this in my hands. He did all of it. No, for real, for real. Cause I don't know, I, I know a little about, uh, Finance and technology, but now I know a lot because hold on, I gotta put my charge on. Because okay. um sorry about that. That's all good. Take your time. 
I think it's crazy. Hold on. I'm on my phone and die. I know little about financial te- fin- finance finances and a little about technology. That's how I know what the most high doing this because I know little about both. And the way I was able to uh do what oh my what is this thing doing? My phone is that crazy. Can you see me now? The way yep. I was able to do do this was through only the power of the most high. He just gave it to me. Like the people behind this are MIT grads, Harvard, all of our people. It's our people. And I don't want to disclose their names too much now because you know I want I you know I just like to keep it uh mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah, Why? keep it legal for now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But Kingdom Pay came along. Well, I most I showed me the Kingdom platform that he wants on earth. Now, technology really can work towards our autonomy. Mm-hmm. You know, there's a dark web going on right now where the oh, government yeah. can't even, can't yes, even sir. To. yes, sir. So imagine mm-hmm. a righteous dark web. Mm. Facts. Facts. <laughs> so that's that's what I'm like. Okay, because I found out some stuff we can do with this stuff right now. I'm like, wow. I didn't even know. I talked to my my team today. I did like, you can do this. And I said, you can do that. He said, I can program this for this. They won't even be able to do this. And so all this autonomy, and I, I'm talking about, and I and I don't want to get the property too much. The market, I don't. Well, just in case they're trying to put chips in us, we don't. Yeah, speak, we don't speak to, your mind. There you we go. We don't speak have to mind. take that. Now mm-hmm. I don't know if I'm fighting against prophecy because there is a scripture about um and I, I battle this too. There's a scripture about people that didn't take the mark and mm-hmm. they got the heads cut off. So I'm like, mm-hmm. okay, but it, I, it, they, I I I don't know if the most high gonna have everybody getting their head cut off. So I'm just trying to figure out if there's a preservation, there's a Goshen. Is yes. there a you know, I believe there is. There will I believe be God gonna preserve certain people, and I think it's gonna be some frantic Christians that read the book wrong. It's like, oh my god, I gotta get my head cut off. Like, but I believe that's going not, and I'm not laughing at that. I'm just saying, like, yeah. because they read it wrong, God will have mercy, but they're getting the heck. Right. So there's, a, there's a Hebrews that are going to be on the earth that's going to fight against this wicked system. Yes, sir. The wickedness of the system we're fighting against boldly. Yes. Period. Unapologetic. It's going to be perfect. But the Kingdom Pay platform helps us as a nation gather on an economic basis. Period. They mm. are everything they're doing now on a economic basis. If they're on Facebook, Instagram, Cash App, Vimo, PayPal, we're bet Netflix, Amazon Stick, anything that they have, we have right now, and better. Mm. Yep. And better. And better. So what I'm gonna do uh, while you talk, you can keep talking. I'm just gonna show the people. Uh, the website for now that they can sign up and they can stay in touch with updates in regards to Kingdom Pay. So I'm gonna drop that on the screen in this, one. That's a second. brochure web. There it is. Yeah, that's a brochure website. Yep, brochure that's a website. Brochure website. We're more than a card, guys. Mm-hmm. I don't even want to tell y'all what we created right here because it's gonna scare whoever's listening. But this be technology. <laughs> no, I'm talking about the other. Uh, uh, I just like to be wise. See that that card technology? Mm-hmm. That's a whole nother game that we created. Yeah. Without Visa and MasterCard. Say it like that. Mm. But you can get a Visa and MasterCard also. Yo, these cards are fire, man. Thank these you. These cards man. is hot. <laughs> the card is just one piece of it. A lot of people yeah, say, yeah. Oh, Brandon's trying to be Russell Simmons. No. You when you see that the full platform is that's just a start. The cash app. The social mobile banking, you know, you got to play the game, fight against COVID. You know how it is. Mm-hmm. But the stuff you're doing right now is on this platform is so robust. It's so like you can start that. You see that right there? Every Hebrew has a business right now that's on, that's hosted by a GoDaddy, a Netflix, I mean, uh, Instagram. Why are you hosting yourself with them when you can host yourself with the kingdom? Mm. And you build your own, check this out, economy with each other on our own platform. Facts. Number one. Number two, we, <laughs> I ain't no joke. Let me try, 
Yeah, we Brandon. Made a, great, listen, man. listen, I don't know, I don't know where to start with this platform because there's so much that we I'm I'm gonna say. So say for example, give you have a business, of course you do. What's, what what would you say? Um uh you're, you're, if you were to start a business on Kingdom Pay platform, what would it be? Give me, give me something. I mean, I got several businesses. One of them would be like computer repair. That's one of them. Do you take? Do you take it on? Like, do you have a, a computer repair uh, site? Um, a micro site, yeah. Okay, let's say computer repair. That's tricky. Okay, I can do that. So, computer repair, you you open up a a, a, a um a platform or a like a Shopify. Or, sure. uh, or or like a, a we'll say a, a a PayPal account or whatever mm -hmm. you want to call it. You open up an online shop with Kingdom Pay. You will have your own card with the Kingdom Pay card with your company on it if we wanted to. Mm -hmm. You want to order that. Mm -hmm. So say Divine Prospects come in. Now check this out. Everybody that got money or got um sorry, everybody that got uh they can get money back from posting what, like, for example, it's like Instagram, you post your food, you post the products you buy, you get nothing for it. You can set a points program that can be on the digital card. On that points program, you said, if you post me 10 times, you're going to get 1,000 points. With 1,000 mm. points, you get 20% off your next computer. Mm. Yep. That's just one thing. Facts. We have financial literacy classes like we have right here on here with the Zoom, all this stuff on mm -hmm. our Kingdom Play platform, which is in the King integrated in the Kingdom A platform. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can watch films on the Kingdom Play platform. You can listen to Hebrew music on the Kingdom Play platform. You can buy people's music on with your Kingdom Pay card on the Kingdom Play. Your, if you're an artist, you can have your own Kingdom pay card with your artist name on in your face mm. and the people buy your music you can give them discounts on your music there you go it's endless bro yep as your brother and just to get this our tech team is so good we can do all this with everybody owning their own data on their sites mm. i don't think people understand how big that is oh that's powerful we man. can have a whole city governed by our platform our technology if everybody mm. had land and their housing, we can govern the whole technology in that city. And be fully independent and autonomous. And be fully independent without the government hacking into our program. Period. Yeah. If you look at the screen, family, so uh, those of you who may be new to FinTech technology, quote unquote, uh, Fin is the financial, tech is the technology. So what it is is that they have this ecosystem, right? So the ecosystem starts or the entry point is a commerce-based uh, platform, right? Where the objective of it is for you to create a digital wallet with your current accounts that you have and use those funds to create a Kingdom Pay account and use that Kingdom Pay account to then push your business, your non-for-profit yeah. or whatever the case is. And what you're doing is you want to reward. So it has a reward system that's attached to it. And those people who patronize you on the Kingdom Pay platform doing transactions with you through the Kingdom Pay platform, they get rewards. And it's a way for you to share the things that are developing, that are happening, whether personally or business-wise, in the platform. And then it segues into a sub-component that deals with uh, musicians, or even artists, right? Or anything that you have, if you do videos, right? Videography, whatever the case may be, it's all linked into the same ecosystem. So once you enter it, think, think about like a mall, right? So you're coming in the mall with your wallet because you want to spend things, right? The mall has an ATM there, right? The mall has different shops and different services. It's a social mobile banking ecosystem that provides yes. community and allows transactions that are rewarded. Right. So it's encouraged for you to stay within that ecosystem and you benefit for it, not only for your business, but your personal life as well. And you can have the benefit of knowing that it's going collectively to the kingdom. Right. So yes. he's serving this for you guys on a civil platter. Right. Taking a buffet, putting things on. You can go to the buffet put and put it on a civil platter and eat because you have to learn the etiquette now before you get into the kingdom. And part of yeah. that etiquette now before the banquet hits is that you got to learn how to eat with your fellow brothers and sisters on the same table. 
Yes, come on. Now. Listen, that, they're gonna get it. <laughs> they're gonna get it. So Thank this is you. Why. You said much better than me. Thank you. <laughs> no, it's all Thank good. You, yes. I, I'm just here to help my brother. You know, and I want people to be able to see how beautiful this is. And again, we can't just be all wait and see type of people. That's what happened in the black community. You go to a brother and say, "Yo, I'm about to start a business, man." He like, "All right, I'm gonna wait and see. You let me know how that go, and then I'm gonna come in and I'm gonna help you out." It's like, bro, I'm, I'm saying that to you to see if you're willing to get behind me. If you go to a Jewish community, anybody that starts a business, they putting money into that business is successful. And then that business turns around, supports the next business, the next business, supports the next business. How can the people who some of us say is not the real Jews use the blueprint that Yah has given his chosen people and benefit from it, but yet we don't want to apply it righteously so we can benefit and we can enjoy the blessings from Deuteronomy 28, 1 to 15, that you know some of you brothers jump over and utilize that as a means of giving us breathing room until we're redeemed. See, what Brian, what, what, we, you know, what we have here with this platform, my brother Brandon is doing, is that he's creating a system for you guys to plug into. Yah is already providing the energy. The electricity, he's already buying today. He's giving you a house and say, look, come into this house. We have this for you, that for you. Just plug in, right? Plug in here, plug in here. And look at all of these benefits, business chat, customer email that you can get. You can do wireless payments with this platform, mobile gift cards and coupons, the point system that we talking about, a reward system, virtual punch cards, mobile e-tickets. If you have an event, all these Israelite events that's going out here, it needs to be done through Kingdom Pay. All of these things. Yep. What's going on? Yeah, Integration, not- Apple Pay, Samsung Pay, Google Pay, right? Closed loop and open loop in regards to how everything is functioning within the ecosystem. And you can even do crypto on it. And we know that's the next level of currency. They even support crypto. So he has everything for you guys on a silver plate. He's saying, look, this is the buffet. Pick what you want. You can eat right here on the silver plate with your brothers and sisters in the kingdom. So why would we want to enjoy that right now before we get to the most high? and redeems us. This is going to be the only catalyst to give us breathing room so we are untethered from the system that is oppressing us. The question is, we're going to choose life or death, right? But like I shared with you, Brian, um, I keep calling you Brian. I'm sorry. My best friend is Brian. I'm getting you and him mixed up. Brandon, my brother, Brandon. Like I was talking to you on the the phone, Brandon. I said, look, you know, when the Most High was sending Joshua to go and renew the covenant with the people, he said, this day you can choose life or death. Choose the most sign yep. of commandments and those who are righteous, or you can choose everything other than that. Well, how can we keep choosing death? We say, oh, we're being oppressed, and, but y'all got a Netflix account. Y'all got PayPal. Y'all got Cash Come App. On. You're going to the store, right? You're still buying cars for them, right? You're still getting Bitcoin from the oppressor, right? You're still doing all these things from the oppressive system. Choosing yep. death, meaning that they're taking our resources out of the community, which only lasts for four to six hours in a black community. So in the seventh hour, they're taking our resources and using it to fund our oppression, using us to suppress people like Nick Cannon because y'all watch the media. So they're using the funds to generate from you guys watching to go and oppress people like that. Using those funds to say, okay, look, we're going to redline you out of these communities. Using the resources to lock our brothers and sisters up to keep it at 98% capacity where the majority of them is African-American males. Using it to deep the public school system what you're sending your kids in. When we have something that can give you life, the things that we're circulating, the energy that God has put in you, the Ruach, you're giving a bit of it, a little bit at a time into kingdom pay into an ecosystem where everybody can eat off of it. My brother Brandon didn't make a dime off of this yet at all. He's nope. not in it. For me. I he no sal- I have not taken a salary off kingdom pay. I'm doing it because I know it's, I know it's going to work. Most of you told me it's going to work. Now, the key is when it works, you know, we got to stay humble as a nation because it's going to work. And they they going to be mad when it works. They're going to be mad. That's why I'm more, I'm more past the, if it takes five, ten years, however the most I'm doing, because the famine's coming. He going to gather his people, man. Mm-hmm. He's going to gather his people. Facts. And you can gather on Facebook, on every other uh, platform, or we can, I'm, I'm, see, I'm not going to cut you all off for being who you are. I'm going to let y'all go at it, argue, whatever. Y'all want to do that stuff. You know, as long as it ain't nothing, just abominations against Torah, I'm not going to go there with it. But when you when you just having fun, talking junk, you know how we do as people. We be, you know, we be going at it. Like, ain't going to be no flag, you know, all that stuff Facebook be doing. We're not doing that. We're going to be so fighting listen, people from, from a Torah perspective. Fact. So you got to understand, social-wise, 
the information that we share on social media now, like Brendan said, is being flagged, right? It's being flagged yep. because even the stuff that we say that comes from a heart of purity, that is our voice, lifting our voice up like a trumpet, showing our people what their transgressions are for the things that are happening to us in society. When we speak out, we are still supporting the social platforms that are oppressing us. And the brother has created an independent platform we can freely speak in a Torah protected environment. Now, how are yeah. you going to still have a conscience knowing that we have this option here and still be able to support the systems that are oppressing, muting, suppressing, and removing our sovereignty that we have in the kingdom? There's nothing there that's- We can honestly have a- to Honestly, I don't want to really say this too much on here, but I'm going to give you a little bit of it. Brother, we actually can really have autonomy with this. And, I, I, and I'm saying that even if we're close you know, with to 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 our our you know our our oppressors, um, data wise and functioning wise and working together wise, we can really have autonomy. Yes. I talked to my team about this today, and I was like, they were like, you know, you can do this. I was like, well, I'm not gonna say, it. I'm not gonna say, it. I wanna, I, I'm not even gonna say it because it's so deep. But they told me something that we have the technology to do, and I was like, wow, just said it like this. The dark web still can't be hacked into. And we're the light web. Uh -huh. and the light web can't be hacked into. That makes sense? That makes sense. <laughs> we got to create, you know what's funny? I'm going to talk about thing. Forget the dark web. We got to create the light web. Mm, that's it. We have not. This the light web. They doing all that that crazy molestation, child trafficking on the dark web. We got to create the light web because the Fact. in between is what we on now. Mm. We got to mm. create the light web now. Dang! I and see, you, and see, look at this. It's so deep because the dark web attracts people that want to hide from society and possibly do things that are wicked and righteous. The light web is going to expose everybody, but only if your endeavors are righteous can you enter in and do business and work and be part of our social club. Come on. That's it. And we ain't greedy. We, the most <laughs> with 10,000 people, we happy. Be blessed with 100,000, we happy. A, a million, whatever he wants us to have, the fact is, like you said, the water well is there. Mm. It's there. Mm. It's there. Mm. There's no excuses. It's, bro, it's so there that you, 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 you. <laughs> Mm. The stuff we have, I, I'm I'm like wow, because because our partners is, is in their 60s and they've been working on this, they've been working on this type of stuff for almost 13 years, mm. and been waiting for the right. Think about this, they've been waiting for the right. This was made for the crit. I'm gonna give you this was originally made for the Christian church. This platform mm -hmm. by my partners. The Most High made it for the the Christian Church to have autonomy, and I was, you know, for me, I'm like, like, look, this is who we, are. and the Most High allowed Israel to get it. Mm. See how Israel handled it. There you go. Because it was literally the autonomy was made. You know, we get in the press. Yep, the Most High blessed on that one. You know what I'm saying? But yep. I'm just giving you all this, like. You can't get mad because it's gonna be some. They call them cleavers. It's gonna be some cleavers going. Oh my god! I don't want to. I don't want to do this. I don't want to take the mark. I don't want to. I don't want to win. You know, I need to figure out what are you guys doing. A cleave. How are they gonna cleave? If we if we yelling at each other. Like how are they exactly. Cleave if we're not doing nothing of light. How do you cleave if we're not gonna do anything to make them? Mm, that's worthy of cleaving to. Y'all's name is of cleaving to. We gotta wear his name like designer shirts. You know what I'm saying? Designer suits. So when people see that the suit, they that's a nice suit. What's the name in it? You get to show them the tag on it. <laughs> Facts. Can't you know what I'm saying? On, that's that's it. Look at that. <laughs> right. So let me so let me segue this way. So Brandon, if, if the community wants to get behind Kingdom Pay, what can they do? Because they have people in the chat that's asking, Brandon, how can we support? Really, there's two sides to this: be a user, consumer. Or you know, rise with us. You can rise with us if you want to. This ain't I ain't asking for. Well, I ain't asking nobody money. I just did a. I did, I, I just did a a, a a a huge acquisition prayerfully. I'm not going to speak too much about it with a very big aggregator 
who has a family brand and he's a comedian. And he loves the platform and he wants to talk about it. Mm. Now, if that deal goes through, you know, we're probably worth about $500 million. Wow. All praise to the most high. All praises to the most high, most Christ, his spirit. All praises to the most high. This ain't me. But it's ain't this. No, no. Guys, I don't know if y'all know this, that, yeah, I'm chairman and CEO of, 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 of Kingdom. Hey, but I'm, this ain't, this ain't brand. I don't own it. See, when you look at a C Corp, I think, okay, Mark Zuckerberg don't own most of Facebook. Mm -hmm. He's face. He, he made himself a billionaire off, off selling it to the people. Are y'all hearing me? He don't own the majority shares of it. So don't, you're not giving Brandon money. You're giving the actual kingdom platform money that mm. we all went off of. Finally. Facts. Facts. Stop. This is not a five, and I'm not knocking any priest. I love the priesthood, but I'm trying to help build the nation. Mm. You're not, this is not Brandon T. Jackson. You know, most high willing, if it wants me to get rich, all praise, we still giving it back. But the, the thing is, this is a structure we have finally where everybody who's working with it can come up. And you know what's funny? White folks, other nations do this all the freaking time. We're free, yeah. guys. If we just do what God says, we are free. I'm telling you, we're free. I've been trying to have an argument with it. Like, you got to wait. I believe for the kingdom of heaven come, you know, that's a whole, I'm talking about living in the, the blessings of Abraham, even in your, in your, and not being redeemed. I believe you can do that. Awesome. So, I so Brandon. The government above us will have our own little thing going on. Uh-huh. So Brandon, so how can they, if they want to sign up now or support now, how can they do it? Go to kingdompay.com. Mm -hmm. If you want to invest in me, we are mm -hmm. about to close out this first round we can't take anything under a thousand dollars we're about to close out this first round and 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 after that we got to go and probably wait a year because we're gonna have to, we're gonna be running it and then we're gonna value your company higher mm -hmm. so if you want to rise with us rise with us because I, I i want that because i want to prove that the father is has good people out here it ain't a bunch of demons out here he got somebody he only got somebody Mm -hmm. I'm the only one either. He got an army of people. He Fast. said I got 7,000 in bow to bell. I think he, Elijah thought he was the only one. So it's like mm -hmm. you got to really understand where we're at. Guys, I need you to really understand that I ain't asking. Stop stop this rumor that Brandon Jackson trying to take the money off Israel. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. I'm a C mm -hmm. corporation. Go do your research on the C corporation. I'm selling shares my company so that means the company the company the key pay platform makes money and does well we all do well my mm -hmm. is victory not no offense i love all my leaders and my priests that's a different structure but i'm saying yeah. how can we give to the priests if we're broke that's the mm. that doesn't work anymore wow. Us wow. being broke and giving the priest that does not work. We got to empower ourselves and give to the priest. Period. That's good. That's good. Period. I'm done. That's I'm good. helping the people on the kingship platform. Listen, this is not, I repeat, we will have teachers on this, by the way. We do support all, all the teachers, rights teachers. I'm not saying we don't support them. Listen, the kingdom platform is not a mosaic Levitical platform. Not saying we don't go by that law. Listen to what I'm saying. We are a David platform. Mm. We're a kingship platform. Mm. We're a to help the nation of people. The spirit in the artificial intelligence is that. Mm -hmm. If you can hear me, if anybody got to hear, hear this. If you program the devil in the matrix, the devil going to be in the computer. If you Fast. program Satan and pornography in the computer, that's what you're going to get. Now, if I program the spirit of David mm. in a program, that's what you're <laughs> going to get. I'm not calling myself David. No, I ain't calling mm. myself nothing but Brandon T. Jackson. Brandon. I'm Brandon. Mm -hmm. I'm a brand son of Jacob. 
Brandon T. Jackson. Mm. That's it. Mm. My name is who I was before I got here. I just want to mm -hmm. show y'all you can work for the most high and, and be wealthy and not you can you can pray for the sick and heal. You can do all these gifts and chill out. Facts. And, and you don't even have to flex. If you want a ring, get a ring. If you don't want a ring, you want to chill, get a G, get a like just like we need to live with God mm -hmm. in our families. That's it. Facts. It's not even hard. Facts. So so that's so I'm that's the first thing. So if you if they want to contact you, you have an email address. How can I reach you? Brandon at King. Listen, do not contact him by any doctrine. Do not do that. Unless it's, <laughs> unless it's ministry. I'm not don't ask no doctrine. doctrine and don't ask him for no money, man. He's not no bank. Unless you guys trying to support Kingdom Pain, we get off the ground, then everybody can eat. You know what I'm yes. saying? I don't want people yes. to use people that a cash cow. Don't be trying to reach out to him to try and get famous or use his fame. Don't do the brother like that. When I met Brandon, did I ever ask you for a dime, Brandon? Did I ever say, no. oh, Brandon, man, put me on your platform, man. I want to be famous. I ne never met on those terms. Mm -hmm. Genuine. We were brothers. And I'm just trying to tell other people, please do not take advantage of my brother. Because we have people that are seers that are watching out for him. And we see certain people, how they move. And we don't want them to infiltrate this thing that he has going on. Only come to him if you have pure intention. So if you truly want to invest in kingdom pay, you have a righteous opportunity giving you contact information that you can contact. Don't ask them about doctrine. Don't say, hey, sir, why are you on the Sabbath talking about this and doing that? This is not what that's for. If you get to know the brother personally, if he allows that opportunity, then you can actually speak to him about those things in fairness and in love. This is about kingdom pay right now because it's for the kingdom to really do what it was designed to do while we're here on the earth. The blessing of the most high that you keep the Torah, Deuteronomy 21 and 15. Scripture says that uh, the wealth that's for the righteous is laid up for sinners. So what the sinners achieve, what they get is laid up for the righteous. And we take that to leave an I inheritance for our children. Aki, I, I, I think people want to stay in the curse. I think when you preach the curse doctrine, you get more followers. And then you preach the blessing doctrine, you sound too much like what they call a Christian. And I think that that's why people are so afraid of curses. I mean, the, the, the blessings, because when you start preaching blessings, if you're living righteously, the most high will bless you. And we don't go to him for just blessings. We go to him. Um, we go to him for, see that's, I, that's that text right there. I just got right there was a very big deal. What You have no, see, and I'm laughing. <laughs> What's funny, I can't answer that right now because one, it's Shabbat. Two, I got, I'm got. i going to have to pray on it. And I'm happy because yeah. I'm laughing because no matter what y'all say, y'all, you don't follow them. The most high ain't going to let, it's like somebody got to be like you, like a, a, an example. And I'm not saying I'm the only one. I'm not saying I'm the only one. But uh, the devil can't win all the time, y'all. This ain't Satan doing this, period. Don't ever give my celebrity or Hollywood glory over my father. Period. Mm, facts. Period. Stop hitting me with, oh, it's because you're a celebrity. No. God made me a celebrity to be a servant to y'all and be a servant mm. to him first. To be a mm -hmm. servant for you. Facts. Period. Facts. He didn't give me a celebrity to take pictures with Eddie Murphy and all this stuff. He didn't get beat. And I would love, I'm animated because I'm funny too. And laugh, y'all want to laugh. I love it because that's who I really am. All uh -huh. that stuff y'all seen on Blotter Ticket, that's the natural spirit God gave me. So even when I'm teaching, I'm funny, like, nigga, oh, he crazy. Oh, it, it, man, he was right right here, brother. Brother, nigga, he, you know, they're like, oh, he going off. I go off sometimes, and it's funny because that's my natural gift. So yeah. I was born to be in the spotlight, but not for the glory of man. Mm -hmm. For the glory of the Most High and for his people. That's it. Facts. I don't even know what you were saying. I just felt the spirit to say. I don't know why you said that, but I'm just letting you know that that yep. I just felt the spirit to say that. I don't know why. You yeah, said you that. good. You good. So no, no. So so how can they reach you if they want to invest right now? Round one, phase one. How can they reach you to invest? Got and let me let me correct. We will have our for music, everything, not for investing, right? Right now, we're 
We're going to close up around hopefully in two weeks. Engineers mm-hmm. are working around the clock. Um, so very hard. Like we raised almost, um, um, we're almost at 150,000 right now. And that's all going towards engineering operators, some you know lawyer costs. I'm very transparent. Our CFO, uh, we just hired him. Uh, hopefully, uh, we'll get we we we'll get the um, we got it's my, we have my two CFOs for taxes, one for operating. I'm very I'm very open. So y'all want to see this? I, I told I told Divine like I'm very open with my platform. So be sure if y'all want to go through the books as we do Israel, please go through them because that's what we're doing now. Um, some has went through the operating costs of the company, and um, some uh, and most of it has went towards uh hiring the attorneys and 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 engineers so that's what the uh, 150 is is being raised for 89 we're about at 89,000 right now um uh, i just got a commitment for another 20,000 so if you want to get on this round which is the best round cuz you're in the round where it's like yo if i put $1,000 in, in in facebook when they was in in the in the bed in the, in the uh the dorm room right now mm-hmm. that's what you're doing mm-hmm. imagine if you put money into facebook when they were struggling Mm. Now and then, now 13, 14 years later, they who they are now. Mm-hmm. They really would be yep. worth, I think, almost sixty five million dollars. Facts. You kept your money in the company. Facts. Think how many people you can help. Think how many if the Gamosai allows that right now. Whatever's going on. Think how many people. Just in general, the, the principal is us working on right now. The principal is one with just DM me. Pay official at Kingdom Pay official DM that. So say that one more time because you broke out a little bit. Say that one more time, Brandon. DM at Kingdom Pay official. You said DM at Kingdom Pay at King official. My my our Instagram page. Oh, your Instagram page. Okay, I could bring that. Me, yeah, I can hear you. No, not my see. Instagram. The Kingdom Pay Instagram page. Sorry. Well, yeah, the Kingdom Pay Instagram. I'm about to bring that up. Hold on. Yep. So they can see it. Kingdom Pay official. All right, let me bring it up on the screen so they can see it. All right, there we go. All right, and bring it up on the screen. Just confirm it for me. Is there any questions? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to ask you some stuff in a second. I just want them to uh, understand what Kingdom Pay is about, how they can support you uh, doing Kingdom Pay. This is it right here, right? Should be. Let me see. Yeah. Kingdom Pay yep. official. That's right? Instagram. Yep. Yep. That's Instagram. Yep. That's Instagram. So uh, follow yep. him on Kingdom Pay official. You can DM him here, and then you can put the request in because this goes towards the Kingdom Pay. Right, the thing, the platform that he was just telling you about. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna move past yeah. that, Brandon, um, and I'm gonna continue to support you on that. I'm gonna do a post tomorrow after the Sabbath, so that way it's a follow up to what we discussed about today for the Kingdom Pay, so people can continue to invest in what you're doing for the Kingdom, my brother. Um, let me move on to a few more questions, and I'm gonna let you go because I know your time is valuable, my brother. The first well, thing yeah, that people, can... okay, cool. I'm the first thing that people, I'm yeah, the first thing people asking me is when is the movie dropping that's what everybody wants to know they're like yo we want to see track and track. Honestly, <laughs> honestly i'm i'm kind of holding it up because i'm 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 such artist i'm a filmmaker yeah. and mm-hmm. i'm doing a little extra i'm doing a little bit extra stuff because that trailer didn't look like it did even when we first shot it and i had to fix it and make i'm holding up the process a little bit when the film is which is looking like this fall, but when this film is where I want it to be, then I'm going to go and and put it out. Because, but we're almost there. We're almost there. Mm. So, I'm so the song fall, maybe uh-huh. fall. So when you did this song, Trapped in Trap, I love that song, right? Trap City, Thank you. and from Trap City, you have the song Trapped in Trap. So, Masha, is that your artist name? You know, people that's ask a, me that's about a, that's a uh, that's one of my artist names. Okay, All I right. go. I I just go whatever spirit. I'm um, how do I say whatever spirit that's the most you're moving in, in right? Time. Yeah, so what, I said whatever spirit like, that you're moving in at the yeah, time. Hi, baby. Hi. 
whatever whatever spirit the most high is putting on me, that's when no 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 thank you. No no babe, can you get them to your Whatever spirit my kids are just they act me. I, I, no, thank that you. kids is the same way. If it was if it was that time here, they would be up right now. Huh? I know this place is down at 10 o'clock. <laughs> no, no, thank you. So whatever spirit the most I was putting on me in that in that time, my son about to come up here. And that's what I kind of just rap under. Like, like I got one one song I got more aggressive and more warlike, and I just say that artist is Malakta Malakta Wu. And ah, I'm not saying I'm these people. I just I rap under the, this a, a certain spirit or energy of 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 the of the essence of. I'm not calling yeah. myself that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the essence thing. It's the essence thing. Like Annette that video is bringing the word, the law. Yeah, of yeah. People, so yeah. Prince my shot. Nice, nice. Okay. So um, the next thing I want to move on. Sorry. To, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. So the next thing I want to transition from there is ask you. Uh, about yeah, this yeah. whole, uh huh. No, I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, my kids just uh, they just loud. No problem. No problem. I'll give you a moment. No problem. <laughs> they they uh, they wilding right now. <laughs> Thank you. Babe. All right. So, uh huh. All right. So the next thing I want to ask you about is um I saw your video that you did. Um, when the Nick Cannon situation was going on about anti-Semitism and stuff like that. Um, can you speak a little bit about uh, this anti-Semitism term and uh, how it's being used as a gag order on people who are saying that we're the true Israelites? Like, what, what's your take on that? Well, we have to fight against anti-Semitism, anti period. You know, Oh. I think it's Phone died, but he lost the signal. Okay, so hopefully he comes back. I just hit him up. Uh, I want to say shout out to um, everyone that uh, gave a donation and super chat. I greatly appreciate that. Um, Everybody hit the thumbs up. Thank you. If you haven't hit the thumbs up yet, hit the thumbs up um, and share this video. Share this video. Hit the subscribe button. All right. I'm going to give a moment for Brandon to return. Let's see if I can find this this old school video so y'all can see. Well, it's not. I keep saying it's old school. It was only like four years ago when I was out in uh, L.A. And, um, you know, we were sitting down and we were eating. It was me, him, Sakari was there. Some other brothers was there. And we was building. Let me see if I could probably find that while he comes back. I think he's coming back up. Okay, there we go. You hear me? All right, back. That's crazy how that happens. <laughs> oh, this is much soon better. As soon as we get deep, I know it's in there. This is much so, better. Um, hold on. Let, let me clear the air because my, my phone uh, is going uh, dead. I put it on the charger and uh, everyone's coming here for some reason. So I'm a, I'm gonna finish what I was saying because that's crazy. Okay. As soon as we get to the meat, you see how that the, the enemy try to do yeah, that? I see that. <laughs> hey, can you, um, can you, uh, I was having technical issues too, so I'm gonna mute you real quick. I'm gonna mute him. So, Brandon, I'm gonna mute you real quick. I'm ready. I'm ready. Me, you ready? Okay, he's ready. All right. So, uh, go ahead. You speaking on anti-Semitism? No, I'm saying we have to fight against anti-Semitism. That everything that we go through in this country is anti-Semitic, and I, I urge our people to really embrace um, who we are. Um, and fight against anti-Semitism. And while Black Lives Matter, what that's not our movement. Our movement is is more, uh, you know, a, a Israelite movement. And so we have to really um, fight against anti-Semitism in that. And if we can fight against anti-Semitism, we can embrace our uh, oppression. And what, as we embrace our oppression, it's easier to fight instead of saying racial equality. Because now Black Lives Matter is more, um, or whatever that movement is. That's I don't, I don't even know what that is. That's not our movement. Our movement is 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 a Hebrew movement, and anybody that hates our people, that calls us niggers, that kill us, they're anti-Semitic. Hello.
Yeah, I'm here. Can you hear me? That's crazy. Now I can. Yeah. Okay, I can't keep it quick either. No, it's okay. Keep going. Keep going. I'll be right back. Keep talking. So, I'll be right back. Anybody that's not fighting against anti Semitism is 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 is, is, is not walking. Talking in truth, because we have been oppressed for 400 years, and we need to uh, really get this uh, get this done. Like we have to, we got to fight. We got to fight for our right as as Semitic people, and and stop fighting against ourselves. You know, so anytime they're doing anything against the Jews, you know, we feel that we have to really fight against it and um black lives matter is not our movement our movement is fighting against anti-semitism and we mm -hmm. have to embrace that mm -hmm. that's great so so when when we see celebrities come out and speak uh about us being israelites right aside from all the other things they say but for us being israelites and then you see the media step in and say oh those are anti-semitic remarks uh, what do you think the agenda is? You know, why are they using terms like this in order to keep us from saying that we the people? Well, I believe that Deshaun Jackson, all these, they got to be educated on um, saying that, you know, they, they're they saying that when you say we're the real Jews, it's like, that's like a, you got to really know how to talk to everybody. You got to know how to talk to the media. That's why a lot of them are. I think God, the Most High, going to choose a spokesperson to speak for Israel because he's going to understand how media can twist things. So, whoever that person is has to understand that when you start saying we're the real Jews and all this other stuff, that that is that is the truth. But you got to understand that. We just got to fight against anti-Semitism. That's what they should have just said. They should have, Deshaun mm -hmm. Jackson said, I'm fighting against anti-Semitism. There you go. Sisters. Yep. That's it. They you don't, keep it you simple. Really saying, all, well, I'm, all saying, the... I'm really 5'8". I'm really 5'8". Hey, I'm 5'8". So, that, like, I, that's not even. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You know what I'm saying? And, Why am I proving yeah, that I'm 5'8"? Yeah. I'm already 5'8". Why am I proving that I get white on? Facts. Why are we trying to prove a beard? Mm, live it, do be it. it. If you're a Shemite, be it. Be it. I'm yelling at other people about not being it. You be it. There you go. That's it. That's it. So I, I appreciate that. That um, you there, Brandon? Me, yeah, I'm here. But see, you see, okay, go ahead. we don't talk about money. That's crazy. We don't talked about money. All this other crap. As soon as we start talking about stuff that's that we need to talk about, the, you, you see that? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I see it. I see it. <laughs> it's all yeah, good. It's all good. Nothing else to do. But interfere with this. So I'm glad you said that because that's the same sentiment I share where I'm saying that these celebrities should just need to focus on building God's people, right? So if, if you say yeah. that this is who we are, then the focus should be on your people. You put your fingers too much and you're taking all these conspiracy theories sometimes and mix it into a gumbo pot when you can just focus on us as a people and showing the world that we are the light by means of what we can provide and contribute to society. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Based on what Yah has put in us. He has given us the kingdom. We have already have elements of it. It's right now. We need to live it out. And then to go and say, yeah. man, you know what? Anytime there's a problem in our city or issue, situation, media, whatever, we can go to these people, right? They're the ones who can actually bring change that we need in our communities. So if these celebrities would just focus on that and not just harp on the finger pointing and the conspiracy theories, I think collectively we'll be able to get much further. Just and that's me, what if you did. Like, that's what you did. If you're a Torah follower, follow the Torah. Follow the Torah and speak Torah. See, what I do, I just speak Torah unto anybody who receives it because the Torah is truth. So if you speak truth, they're going to see it anyways. If you start speaking about truth in a way where they can't receive it, it's like the most I say, be wise as a serpent, Christ and harmless as a dove. So you got to understand how to even speak. If you just 
going on something, but like, we the real, it's like, okay. And I'm the real, I'm the real 5'8 dude. <laughs> I'm the real guy who was in movies. Like, that's obvious. Like, we're stating the obvious and we're yelling at people for the obvious. Mm-hmm. We've always been special. We've always been different. We've always Man. been oppressed. The Jews, we've been oppressed since the Israelites. There's been so much anti-Semitism with our Holocaust when we first came into this Egypt and with our um, oppression um, when we first came into Egypt. The Jews and our Holocaust with slavery was so ridiculous that it actually matches up with the scriptures in the Torah. So our Holocaust as Jews coming into this country and slaves as slaves, we have to embrace that and fight against anti-Semitism. Mm-hmm. We need racial equality. We need to fight against anti-Semitism. Anti-Semitic mm-hmm. people. Mm. That's yeah. what's been killing our people. It's been anti-Semitic stuff, not racial equality. We ne- that's the, that's not a movement we should be fighting for. Why are we fighting for racial equality? That's not the movement of scripture. Mm. The movement mm. of scripture is fighting for the sons and daughters of Jacob. Mm. Mm. They're switching the narrative. Take mm-hmm. the narrative and mm-hmm. fight against anti-Semitism. Mm. Fight against anti-Semitism. We are being oppressed every day and economically, everything. They got to stop oppressing us Jews. L'chaim, shalom, baruch Hashem, stop oppressing us. Mm. Awesome. Awesome. And, 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 and again, you're just echoing the same things I'm saying. And you know, Brandon, it's just unfortunate that, you know, you don't have more celebrities that are actually saying, Wow, Brandon, man, I really woke my eyes. Well, what is you gotta under, you gotta admit, Brandon, when COVID 19 hit this year, it was a blessing in disguise. And when I say that, I don't mean the death, you know, tolls and people they getting sick. <laughs> I'm saying it has removed all the distractions. People can't yep. go to the movie theaters, people can't go to the clubs, people can't go to the bars, there was no more sports. You can't even go to work. You have to work from home or stay home, right? So now what is happening is these things are happening. Now you're forced to confront what's going on in your TV, and you're seeing our people getting killed by the police. And now these celebrities are looking at this, forced to confront it because they don't have an outlet to do anything else. And now all of a sudden it's like, wow, something is really wrong here. And this is the stuff that we've been trying to do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Because God have allowed COVID to happen for them finally to sit down. God sat me down four years ago, and they're finally sitting down, but they just they're, they're just vomiting at the mouth. When Paul talks about giving a a, a a a a um a platform to somebody who's not seasoned, that's all that is. Mm-hmm. So not seasoned in, in what to say, but you know it was very simple. The Sean Jackson says. The anti-Semitic remarks and and the actions against our people has been going on since the Holocaust of slavery. And let me let me bring this out. Some people may not know, but the word Holocaust also means a sacrificial offering. That was a historical uses of the term Holocaust, right? Before mm-hmm. it got applied or before it got the connotation to the Jews and what happened to them in Germany. So what, what one thing that really blows my mind is that when this anti-Semitism thing goes around and there's always an appeal of empathy, right, towards the Jews that is recognized in society. But what about us in the diaspora here? We've been through a Holocaust or a sacrificial offering, you know, by the colonists for almost 400 that's all, years. That's how you say it. I, I, don't explain it. I don't explain it. I just be it. I say the Holocaust of our slavery. The Jews that came in here in slavery in 1619. I don't say the Africans. Mm-hmm. The African Americans. 
Yeah, we are African. Yeah, I get it. We are. Yeah, we are. We are. Our bloodline is Israel. So I don't go into that. I don't go into all the narratives. I just say the Holocaust, the sacrificial offering that happened to us in 1619, our Holocaust, the Jews' mm -hmm. Holocaust in 1619. Mm. Let's bring the narratives back to the truth. <laughs> there you go. And Stop say, why are we not discussing this? Stop. Because we're talking and we're trying to explain ourselves. Be it. Facts. Be it. If I'm on if I'm on if I'm on CNN, I'm gonna talk to them about the Jewish or the Jew, as they want to if they say Jewish, the Jew, the Israelite Holocaust, they're gonna say Jewish because that's what they want to say. I'm gonna say the Israelite Holocaust of 1619 when we came over here from the house of Judah, we came in America. I don't say the Africans came here. Because when you start saying that, you're lying to yourself and the whole world. So they were anti the anti-Semitic. And now we round back to the the problem between the the Afro. Hebrews and the European people follow the Torah mm -hmm. and the Talmud. Why is there a division? Let's just speak righteousness. Forget all the the rhetoric. Let's just go to the bottom line. If there's one home bound for the slave, I mean for the stranger, and one law for the for 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 the for the uh a uh, 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 home bound. Either way. If, if there's an argument, why are we arguing about this? Mm. Why are we second-class citizens even in Israel? If there's one law. So I speak righteousness. Mm -hmm. I don't have to speak rhetoric of mm -hmm. arguing. Why is there gay parades in Jerusalem? If we follow in Torah. Mm -hmm. If I go to Hollywood, I know somebody gonna do a cartwheel into the club. <laughs> yeah. But if I go to Jerusalem, I know that you can't bring that there. But it's even mm. more. Mm. So all the rabbis, I challenge you. Why aren't you stopping this and not following Torah? Mm. Speak truth. Speak truth to life. Mm -hmm. Don't talk about all these other narratives or they're gonna get you. Mm -hmm. That's your public service announcement. You there? I want to make sure we didn't lose him. You there, Brandon? You don't know what's going on. You hear me? I can hear you now. Go ahead. You hear me? Yep, I can hear you. I'm going to have to get off this vlog. But hold on, let me see if that might be better. Do you hear me? I can hear you. Are you off the Wi-Fi now? Let me see if that might be better. Do you hear me now or no? Yes, no? Yeah, I can hear you. Yep. Speak truth and scriptures. Stop arguing about who you already are. Just be it. That's so we just be it. I'm fighting against anti-Semitism, period. Mm. I'm fighting against anti-Shemitism, mm -hmm. period. Mm. The house of Jacob are Shemites. The house mm -hmm. of Israel are Shemites. That's it. So why are we fighting another narrative? Why are we Fact. saying we, wow, I'm the real, you the real, we the real? Okay. Be it. That's it. <laughs> the Most High never, the Most High always proved Himself with us being in the background. Yeah. So why are we That's talking it. about what we are unless the Most High is going to prove us? There you go. Yeah. The only way going to prove us if we doing what He said to do. He gave us the there structure. There you go. There you go. So people should just be able to look to see our behavior and be able to see who we are from our behavior. It's that simple. You feel what and I'm saying? And they only on the basketball court. Unless we're working for them, they see us special, but it's only if we're on the basketball court making them laugh, doing some slave stuff. That's, yep. You know, I'm done, when, bro. I'm done. When, when, when we start doing... Out. Go ahead, Brandon. Do you hear me? Yeah, go ahead. The, 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 the Jew argument got to stop. 
If you a Jew, go 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 be one. That's it. Be it. Show it. Mm-hmm. Why are we arguing? I'm not gonna argue whether there's food in my refrigerator or not. I'm not gonna argue if I'm on the computer with you, on the on the on my FaceTime with you, uh, on, on Steamyard. I'm not gonna argue that. That's stupid to argue. Why am I arguing the truth? Mm. Be it. That's it. There you go. It's just out of control. It's annoying. I don't even talk about it. <laughs> we the real. We fight against anti-Semitism. You see, I talk about it on my platform. Oh yeah. Yeah. They're like, what do you mean? We're time. fighting against anti-Semitism. That's George it. George Floyd most likely was a Hebrew, and he was he got he got killed. If we know if, if that's even real, but I think it's real. I think I'm, it may be. I don't have time for my conspiracies, but I'm saying mm-hmm. whatever happened with George Floyd and all this movement that's going on, that's anti-Semitism. It's not racial mm-hmm. equality. It's not Black Lives Matter. It's not about Black people. Lives matter. It's about Hebrew lives matter. Mm-hmm. Period. Mm-hmm. And I dare Black Lives Matter to come against us Jews. <laughs> Wow. So tell they master since they uh, tell them Hebrew lives don't matter. Mm. They're not gonna say that. They're not gonna say that. Definitely not. You know why? Because they're scared of the Jews. They're scared of us. There you go. As there you we go. Are. Because they don't want they don't want anything to happen to them. So no mainstream outlet is gonna say it's not about the Jews. We're gonna say. It is about us, Shemites. Mm-hmm. We're being oppressed. We don't like Black Lives Matter. Hebrew Lives Matter. Kingdom Lives Matter. Forget your Black Lives Matter. I dare you to challenge Hebrew Lives Matter. Matter of fact, mm-hmm. we need to do Hebrew Lives Matter and do some marches. But I actually, you know what? That's a waste of time. But if I had time, I would do marches with Hebrew Lives Matter. But that's a waste of time. That's a waste of time. Mm-hmm. And I would love for Black Lives Matter to come against Hebrew Lives Matter. Facts. Facts. So Brandon, we have so we have about um seven minutes left on the show. Um, is there something else that you want to speak on? You know, you can always come back at any time. All you know what I'm saying? That don't have the spirit of the most high. I hope the most high wake y'all up for real and y'all repent. That's all I'm saying. And I said mm. it. All these people that starting religions and not building the kingdom, I, I'm worried for y'all. Period. That's it. I'm dropping the mic on that. And I'm not, I'm not arrogant with it. I'm just telling y'all, all the priests I came to that didn't go with what we're doing over here in the kingdom platforms, I I don't know what spirit y'all working under. And I'm not saying because y'all don't support me. I'm saying that because like the structure was given that was given to you was to give back to each other and to work together as a people. If you're not trying to do that as a people, mm. give me a scripture and an excuse why not to work together. That's your heart. Mm. They will always find a scripture why not we working together. Why we not working together? <laughs> find a scripture to work together. Facts. Facts. That's, I'm dropping the mic on that. All these fake priests. The most high, thus says the most high. I'm gonna tell y'all right now. The most high got another generation he's gonna raise up. All mm. these fake priests out here, I hope you teach these kids because they're going to be the ones that are really going to have it. I'm telling y'all. There you go. Yep. Remember, listen, and when the locusts come to America, remember Mm-mm. this. The famine is here. So all mm. the ones that say the most high with you, you trying to make money off the people, all this other stuff, I pray that the most high open your eyes and we all work together. That's what I pray. I ain't praying no judgment. I'm praying the most high work with y'all because that famine coming. That them 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 locusts gonna come, they gonna be in and in, in they gonna be in a California. They gonna eat up this. They gonna come here and that's gonna be a sign of a famine on this on this in the, on this land. Mm. I'm saying, I'm saying that. I'm saying that in a way where the father showed me in the vision what's gonna happen, and and people think I'm crazy. And then when it happens, then they want to go. Oh no, we man that man. We everybody me. me. Man, we've been knew that was gonna happen. I'm like, okay. <laughs> yeah. He sends people that visions. He says prophesy. 
to show show us how to go, how to move, and in the spirit, if, if y'all challenging it and, and and being like over, it's like, bro, I'm over it. I'm done. If the most high be yeah. with you, let him be with you. I love you. You always are welcome over here with the game and the platforms. I'm never gonna be like, oh, I you don't agree with this. Uh, no, you guys are welcome over here. My arms are open to everybody over here, and I'm showing the true love of Christ in a way where we gotta love each other. Even through our differences, as long as it's not abominations and craziness, and even that we gotta pay for repentance for, for our brothers and sisters. If we're not moving in that spirit of love and not talking about it, I don't care. Like I, mm-hmm. I don't even want, I don't even want to mess with y'all. So I, I'm trying to see if y'all even really the priest. I, I'm, I want to see. I need to see some miracles mm-hmm. come out of Israel. Mm-hmm. Y'all the priest, where's the miracles? Y'all the prophets, where's the miracles? Mm-hmm. We waiting on the spirit, right? What man? Come on, great is thy faith. Yeah, what is I'm done? I'm done. Where, where the miracles at, man? Mm. If we the priest, where the miracles? Why did they need to say we Israel? Facts. I'm, I'm dropping the mic on that. I'm saying that for a reason. I don't care. I'm calling them out. All awesome. these fake priests out here. I'm calling them out. Where the miracles at? Where the the, the lame walking? Where's the deaf speaking? Where where's the where's the miracles at? Where's the call them down? Mm-hmm. I'm, not texting, I'm saying, let's come on. It's it's, it's, it's this time. The, mm-hmm. the most high way to move. If we ready, he he waiting on us. That's all I'm saying. Awesome. He waiting on us. Awesome. Right. So, so so with that, um, yeah. So with that, I'm gonna tell you, family, that this is not going to be uh, Brandon's last time on this platform. Uh, when we talk in the future, we're going to have uh, other subject matters that we can cover and discuss. The purpose of this is that I wanted to give him an opportunity to express to us what Kingdom Pay is and for us to start supporting our own if we want our own. Right? A lot of times we're going to wait and see, but then when people put propositions before us, are we willing to say, okay, I'm going to invest with my brother and see where it goes, right? And like I said, I vetted him, I co signed him. And like I said, I know the brother personally, right? And because of so, that's why I have him on platform. And that's why I'm saying that I'm going to get behind him and him. And that if y'all are watching and y'all also want to have an ecosystem where we can do everything that's protected by Torah and supported by our community, that's the best way to choose life in this day and age on behalf of the Most High. We can do it if we support and each other. Have some not, let me make sure, too, you guys know, you will have some. I cannot turn away this service to everybody. You will have some non tour stuff. If you see on there, if I was the people, you see people witness to them. Hit there them up go. in their DM. Don't there be like, go. why you on here? You ain't no real Hebrew. <laughs> Get out of that. Most high creating a well for people to be found, to fish for Bad. people. So don't be arguing on this platform or you will get, well, I mean, I ain't going to delete you. I'm just going to give you some warnings. But I'm just saying, there I'm just saying, go. like, just show love, man. We got to show the love of the Most High Christ. So I agree. Go. I agree. All right. So thank you for coming on the show, Brandon. I appreciate you, my brother. You're my brother. As always, man, I will never change, man. Um, I'm staying in touch with you uh, offline, right? Thank you for coming on the show, blessing us with your, your wisdom, your insight, and your platform, opening up to the community. This is something that you could have offered the world, but you decided to offer it to the kingdom, you know, and we appreciate it for you allowing the most high to use you and your status for the service of the community. You know what I'm saying? So family, thank you for watching. I'm going to close out our uh, Freestyle Friday um, so that way we can end off at about two hours. Uh, please tune in later on this week. I'm going to go live again. And then next Friday, we're going to have our next live stream uh, where we're going to do you know, what we always do here on the platform. Um, and if you have any questions for Brandon, anything like that, you know, you got to share with me. I'll vet through it, and then I'll send it over to him if it's genuine. And the brother can answer it next time that he's on a platform. All right. So thank you so much for your time, Brandon. Go ahead and finish being a dad, a great dad like you are, and a servant thank of the most high man. Enjoy the rest of your evening. And like I said, we're gonna talk until I get out there to LA. I should be there next month. All right, hit me later. Let me know about some questions that was on the thing. Okay, no problem. Thing. All right. Hello, family. All right. Hello, my brother. All right, see you guys. Love y'all so